Ty, the good news in all of this is we are finding out from the assistant fire chief Ronnie Harris that nobody is hurt. When crews were initially called out here, they were worried that three people were possibly trapped inside, but the three people who live in this home we're going to show you here were not here at the time. So we still see some paramedics standing out here with a stretcher, but I am told by the assistant fire chief that again, nobody is inside this badly burned home. It's unclear what caused the fire to start, but it started around 530 this morning and crews got out here. They believe that the fire had started in the front room where Nick Lopez arrived at the scene a little bit before us uh, as this fire was still going on. But it, uh, the assistant fire chief tells me that it didn't take them very long to put this fire out. So that's some good news in all of this too and again the three people who were supposed to be here this morning were actually not inside the home when crews got here but we still have a lot of crews out at the scene we've got the washington park fire department still here as well as one ambulance left again there are three ambulances here when we first arrived here but nobody was hurt in this fire crews are still working to determine what exactly caused this fire to start i'm told they're going to be out here for about another hour or so and then illinois uh, fire marshal's office is going to be taking over what exactly caused this fire to spark. They do not think it's suspicious at this, this point in time, but we do see police out here and we'll keep you posted with the very latest and you'll hear from the assistant fire chief coming up in our next half hour. Reporting live here in Washington Park, I'm Laura Simon.